Hello, welcome back to another week in my life in New York City. It's Monday, had a lovely workout this morning. Just did a lot of cleaning. I wanna show you guys my outfit. Look at this super cute set. I just got in the mail from Thrive Society. It's a skirt, which is really nice. And then this fun little top. About to record the podcast with my co-host Brooke. If you guys don't know her, you're crazy because we are together all the time. Called Gals on the Go every Wednesday. Why does my, I haven't like talked a lot today because I've been alone mainly. And I'm realizing my voice just, I must have lost it this weekend. <laughs> but we are doing our annual, at least I think we did this last year, our summer bucket list episode. Things that are on my summer bucket list, things that are on Brooke's summer bucket list. And it's always a fun time, kind of like the kickoff to our summer content on the podcast, on our individual channels, stuff like that. But really pumped. She's on her way right now. And then we have a lot of things to cover. So we're going to have a little quick meeting after and just get a ton done because we text back and forth getting stuff done. But like there is nothing like sitting together and getting stuff done. This week also is my last week home before I go to Greece with a ton of my college friends. I'm so excited. We're calling it a delayed grad trip because um, we never did one. <clears throat> and I'm really pumped about that. So this is like my first European travel since before 2020. So um, I want to do it right. And I'm really excited. We're going to Santorini and Mykonos. I literally can't wait. Um... I will be vlogging my, the best I can. So I need to get like all the travel mini, I, I need to get the adapters, I need to, you know, do all of the proper things. So you guys are gonna come along with me this week. Um, a little glow up with me. I'm doing something a little different to my hair, so that'll be fun. I need to get a pedicure. I'm drinking a kombucha to record. Um, but yeah. And then we have a Taylor Swift concert on Friday, but that's gonna be its whole other vlog. I need to dedicate a whole vlog to the Eras tour because that's gonna be so much fun. We are all set up to record. I typically will draw the shades just so there's no backlight and then I'll turn these puppies on. A little shelf update if you didn't see my Instagram story. I got a couple things from Jonathan Adler. I'm really pumped um, for my shelf, so I kind of switched some things around here. These are all from Jonathan Adler. These are um, decanters, so you technically p could put alcohol in them. I just love how they look. I did whiskey and gin, two liquors that I do drink. And then this is actually a candle, and it actually smells really good, and I could burn it and then just keep this. I just think this is gorgeous. And then I had this, which was a prop we used for Gals in the Go Shoot sometime, and I was like, wait, why do those look kind of cute together? Like a little pop of color. A part of me, comment down below what you guys think. When I, I film a lot of like Instagram reels and TikToks here of like outfits and when you can just like see the Tito's in the corner, it just kind of gives a weird vibe. So I'm wondering if I should switch this with that and bring the match boxes over here. So it's more of a clean aesthetic when you're looking from he like here. I don't know, it's like a little thing, but let me know what you guys think. Guys, Brooke and I just realized the last two weeks of recording, we're giving Chessie and Meredith Blake. It is, this is our new personas. I'm, it's uh, only when we record. Yeah. I don't know. Can I fix you a snack? Oh, the darling. I'm Meredith Blake. <laughs> um, but yeah, the last two weeks of recording, Brooke's oh, been wearing yeah. like a button down and I've been wearing know. like sporty chic. It's been really random. I mean, you're yeah. sporty chic too, but then you throw over the button down and it's giving Chessie in the best way. I need it because, like, I was like, oh, I it's don't chilly in here. It's bra. Well, yeah, you're <laughs> It's really chilly. No. It's never a good temperature in here. No, but I would prefer that. But then I was like, I don't want to wear a sweatshirt because, like, I know, yeah. cause it's summer. Yeah, we gotta it's be summer. like, we're just like, I know, I like ah. this moment. Ah! Yeah. So, yeah, it's coming to you live from Chessie and Meredith Blake. And Brooke brought me this necklace she got us from Adina Eden. They sent it. I didn't pay for it. Yeah, but you set it up. Yeah, yeah, no, I said it. So cute. No, I, I take a picture. I'm like, I'm like, don't worry about don't it. Worry. Yeah, it's, it's on Adina. <laughs> it's on Adina, not to be confused with her Adina. Yeah, no, it's not. <laughs> I love it so, so much. Cute. It's so pretty and bejeweled. Um, so, yeah, so excited. We're talking about the Taylor Swift concert. We did our summer bucket list. Talked about my feet. <laughs> it's a yeah. whole episode. Oh, I, I made Danielle get into it. Yeah, she's <laughs> like, I need to know about these flip flops. Yeah, All right. Sorry, I'm like keep I'm keeping you so Oh no, what? I I have nothing really to go for, so you're good. <laughs> Yay! Bye. Alright, we're gonna do something fun. And if Cass is okay with it, I'm gonna vlog a little bit of it. I've got my tripod right here, um, ready to go. As you can see, I have some clothing out here. I bought honestly a lot of stuff for Greece, or I've just been collecting stuff throughout the few last few weeks. But I wanted a couple like boom, shazza outfits. 
and I definitely believe in myself and I definitely can pick out some things but I love supporting my friends and my friend Cass is a stylist at Moda and she does great things and she styles on the side as well but um, I wanted to do some styling with her through Moda Operandi which is a website and they have amazing designers, amazing brands um, and I honestly love her sense of style. I was like, can you just help me pick up a couple things? So got a lot of things. I know not everything's gonna fit or like work in the way the plan is to return the things that I don't think are my vibe. Um, but she was like, it's probably better to get more than less. You can make sure you have like that's what stylists do, and then we return. Um, but yeah, I'll keep the things that I want to bring to Greece and I might keep some things that I'm like Oh, maybe not for Greece, but for Montauk or something like that or for the summer So I started laying out some things and she was like, wait, no, that's like what I do <laughs> But I couldn't help myself. So I started laying out some things. I'm excited So I'm gonna vlog some of the process have some fun accessories over here I'm excited because I think she'll be we'll try something on and it's like, okay What accessories do I have that could elevate this look so I'm pretty pumped just waiting for her to get here. It's gonna be fun. Okay guys, wearing this dress from Cold Gaia. First up, Cass went into my closet to see some shoes. Again, not gonna end up keeping everything because I can't. I just can't, that's too much. But, do I want to keep everything? Yes, this is gorgeous. <laughs> We're gonna try to keep some out. nudes. Let's bring some nudes. Also, this is Cass. She's been, if you watch the Miami vlog, she was all in. I'm back, baby, she's back. Um, this is good because some of these are chunky heel, which I feel like is better for for this kind of vibe. Well, more so just for for comfort. It's so cobbly. So these I was hoping to bring to Greece. Yeah. So maybe let's try out these and see how they look. Yeah. Because I thought they'd be good ankle support and like. It's so cobbly. You have to be like. It is so cobbly, and I want to dance and feel yeah. comfortable. This is so fun, guys. When I was putting on my dress, she was like pulling up my boobs and like, I was like, this is, and I felt no weirdness. I mean, you probably do this all the time. Oh my God, yeah, I'm, I'm always in someone's coochie. It's pretty crazy. Yeah, this is just one of those trips. I'm gonna have to pick my my battles and like, I can't bring every pair of shoes. So no. we'll see, oh. But these look perfect. These and look perfect. And then I even think with the earrings we got, Oh yeah, let me take these out so we can just pop them in. I didn't realize these were clip-on, that's so yes, fun. I ordered them too. Thank you. Ben, like Amon, how do you say it? Bonamon. Bonamon. Yeah. So cute, yeah, I yeah. love these. I knew this one. I'll put it back to. So and they're cute. lightweight, so they're comfortable. I, I mean, these look so good too. Maybe I'd wear my hair like this, or like a slick back. I obviously, I probably should just, ugh, I don't feel like taking all these necklaces off right now. What, to like assess the scene? Yeah, do you need me to? No, it's okay. I'll just maybe like put them behind. Put the other one on. And then maybe oh, to like right. tie in the gold. You oh. do like the gold purse. That's so cute. Okay, let's take a picture. Oh yes, yeah, so then what, you take a picture and then we have them all? Yeah. This is so official. I feel like it's a celebrity. Phone, my phone's gonna die. Oh yeah. Actually, no. Lighting. Yeah. Though yeah. no, it's so cute. And then you're just, you're so cute that you're posing, you're so cute, people are just like, I know, and I know that, but I can't do that. <laughs> that is all I hate my, I can't, I can't. I can't. I can't. You're so cute. <laughs> oh my god, I'm literally dying. <laughs> so, so in style, usually when you're styling people, they're just Yeah, like, like everyone just stands in fitting pictures and like just it has no emotion. I know, and I've done that before but once. that's cute. But then you go back at the photos and you're like, I, I know, hate that. that. Okay, okay, let's leave the shoes up. on. Okay. Okay guys, here's the next dress I have on. I knew when Cass sent me this I was gonna like it because it's just very like midi. I mean I told her to and she knows like I am more of like a long dress girly. This I like because I have room to walk and dance. This would be, a lot of these are like night outfits. We have some day outfits as well. Um, but it's so cute, it's very snatchy. And we kept the same Shoes on. Okay. Here she comes. Oh, we got many bags. Oh, sometimes I like to see because I do feel like it could be cool to do like a monochromatic. I can just do the all brown. Oh, that looks so good. Or we could do something fun like an orange or. A... Oh, I also meant to tell you. I have to show you a picture. I'm borrowing a Jacquemus, like a tan Jacquemus bag. Oh, that's so. Good. I'll show you a picture just for future. Yeah. Or for this. Well, I'm also thinking like this will probably coordinate with some other looks. Oh, the green, yep, yeah. and that's easy to pack. And so will this one. Yeah. So we could also do like a pop of green or yellow. I love the green. Yeah. 
Yellow is good. I, lo I love a green one. Yeah. I really like the monochromatic too. Me too. Okay, let's stick with the brown. I think that's my favorite for right now. Yeah, this is so cute. But if it doesn't work with another look, then we can raise Yeah, this. thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is your one outfit. Yeah. I'm not bringing it. Yeah, we need to coordinate. But I'll show you the other bag that I'm borrowing because it might work for some. Yeah. <laughs> no? <laughs> no, but like, they actually do end up looking so cute. Because then I'm like, that's what I'm really, if I stand yeah. like this, I'm going to be like, I don't want to wear that. Yeah. No, it's really cute. Okay, but, fine. I really like how I look in this. Yes, so. it's really snatching. Very snatchy. All right, guys, next up. Let's get started. This is so fun. So fun. Put this dress on it's now. It's like fun because you get to pack simultaneously. I know, I'm like, I'm packing right now. We're pulling stuff aside. So this could be a night or a day look, I think we decided. She said that these shoes I have would be great for like daytime, nighttime, I don't know, gold, sunny. Oh, sunny. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because it's yeah. the daytime. Yeah. I don't need to wash these so bad. Cute. The lens. Okay. Now I take a picture. She's like, you don't have to take off the heels. No. It's too much to have to do that. I'm going to smile. Cute. Yeah. One thing about me, I'm going to smile. <laughs> Oh, I do. Oh, my hair's all messed up, but I do like the sunglasses. Yeah, like the gold. Yeah. I feel like an influencer. Guys, this one is a fave. <laughs> Look how good. I, and Cass, like, she's just, I put it on, she's like, yes! <laughs> well, also, because we sized down to an extra small, because this style runs a little big, so we were a little nervous, but it's perfect. I know, I was like, dude, extra small. <laughs> but I see what you mean, because it, like, it's yes. that material, it pulls it, and it has this, like, metallicness to it with this bag. So easy, I can pack this in my. Yes. Uh, suitcase, no problem. Just too. slip it in. So cute. <sighs> Love. Yay! 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 <laughs> Good <Yeah>. stuff. <laughs> Next up. Okay, so here's an example of like a, a no. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be real, you know? Yeah. Love the idea of this, but mm -hmm. it's just a little too short here, but it's so sick. It's really cool. The back's but great. The I cooch, just like don't. Yeah, the, the coochie, coochie showing. Will come out yeah, to we play. Yeah, the coochie showing. No, but it's, I mean, this is a beautiful dress. Yes. Made for someone not. Someone made. else. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. Yeah. Guys, we have another one. We've had a couple. Mm -mm's. But then we also had one that I was like, I'm not even going to show the vlog because it's, it's really, it's out yeah. there. It's out there. Um. So love this. What's the name of the brand again? Chow, Chow Lucha. We debated which bag, but we ended up deciding that one. Cause it's just more simple, like running air, running errands, running errands, running errands. <laughs> shopping. <laughs> and then we have a little Prada sandals on. This yeah. is so. We love a dad sandal. Cute. Yes, I've always wanted some. So these are really fun. Yay! Yay! Oh my gosh, this is a good like day to night. Yes. I actually like you literally could wear it with this god sandals. I was gonna say I don't hate it with the sandals. It's no. not a sin. What you is can, this? Oh, oh it's just a... Yeah, you can like take if you want into like no, really. No more slits. Yeah. <laughs> but oh, wow, this fabric. Yeah, but like I was saying, like I think this shirt would be really cute with like a jean. This is everything. Yes. Snatch. And it's super cute with the skirt, or you could where both. Yeah. I know. Wow. I wish I had a longer torso so you could see some skin. <laughs> but I forget like how the model wore it. But I love this. No, it's really I cute. really like it with the sandals. I know. Or I it's with, cute. With but there might be one night where you're like, I can't do this anymore. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Do you have white heels? No. And just chunky platform ones. I don't yeah, because then the I vibe. think that I would do the gold. The Jacquemus bag might be the exact color of this, so if it is, then that. But if it's not, then I would do the brown. Okay. So, I'm just, I'm just gonna hold neither. Yeah. I'm gonna go with the Jacquemus bag. Yeah, let's just decide. Okay, cute. Oh, I love this. I really like that the top. tag. I yeah. really like the top, is what yes. I'm obsessed with. Yeah. And the skirt's really cute, too. Yeah. I wonder if you should try it on, try with the top on with some jeans. Guys, she had the idea for me to put on these Madewell pants. Oh my gosh. I love They're really cute. Really cute. Yeah, love. I'm truly this top. It, yeah. It does what it needs <laughs> to. It's giving. It's, it's giving. giving. Is that a wrap? That's a wrap. Woo! Woo! We did it. That was so much fun. Thank Yay, you, Cass. Of course. Go follow Cass on Instagram, Cass Adula. <laughs> um, I'll be tagging her throughout the trip, so it'll be easy to find. Yeah. Um, and also, when this vlog goes up, well, I'll have just gotten degrees, so actually, I don't know if I'll have anything up, but go follow me on Instagram, Anthony and Carolyn. Yay. <laughs> well, that was fun. Um, Cass left a while ago, and then I was just getting some work done. I had some edits for a brand. 
and I ordered food again. I'm just like that time before traveling. I'm like, do I get groceries? Do I not? I should have gone get groceries, but I was so hungry and I was like, ah. so I ordered Westville. I, if you're looking for like a semi-nutritious option when you're like ordering food, I love Westville. They have salads. They have a lot. I like to get the market plate. I think it's called. So I get the chicken and then you get two vegetables or two sides. Um, and I love their broccoli and their green beans. So that's what I did. I'm going to dig in. But yeah, it's cold in my apartment right now. Oh, I just took another shower. I was just, I need to put up the temperature a little in my apartment. I was getting cold. And then I was like, all I want right now is like a hot shower. And I was like, all I want to do is walk. I washed my hair on Friday, so it's Monday. I was like, it's time to wash my hair. And I just needed the full, like nothing like a full shower. Not just like when you have your hair up in a bun. My dinner was so good. <laughs> The way they cook their chicken is like, I can't cook my chicken like that. So now I'm just sitting here. I have a lot to do. I just like, I'm still catching up for my Florida trip on work, but then I'm prepping to leave again. But we make it work. And I'm very thankful for that, so. The vibes continue. <laughs> to actually no I probably shouldn't do lunch right now that's so dumb to start it now uh, my hair is air drying I was just trying on this sweat set that I got from Aritzia it's really comfortable it's their TNA brand it's the cozy fleece and um, I just wanted another sweat set from them because I love it so much I got a medium and top and bottom because if I'm wearing a sweat set I found if I get like a super large sweatshirt that I just never want to wear the set because I just think it looks like really baggy um so i love this i'm watching youtube right now um but yeah it's this beautiful blue color and i thought it was perfect for my grease trip for like all the airplane rides all the airplane on the way there and back and then like chilling in the hotel stuff like that so this is gonna be my travel i just better not get any stains on it my biggest enemy are oil stains so I just can't, but like it's so soft and everyone asks me like, are Aritzia sweat sets worth it? Yes, however, I find they don't have a lot of options in store, so buying online is better. They have all the colors, all the sizes you could want, and they're so comfortable. So this will be my travel outfit, and I'm very excited about it. <laughs> oh, all right, I can't. My head is starting to hurt really bad despite the blue light glasses. So we're gonna have to stop. It's 10 15. I'm honestly like not even in the mood to like, sometimes once I'm like done working for the night, I'll like go to my couch or then watch TV, but I'm honestly so tired. That actually would make sense because it's so dark. That lighting's better. That would actually make sense while I'm tired because I woke up at 6 40 or 7 15 this morning. Uh, because Ryan slept over last night, so he had an alarm go off. But I was going to wake up at 7.45 anyways, so I don't know. I'm just tired. I was going to Dyson Air Straight my hair, the new tool I have. I showed it earlier in my vlog today. I probably should. I probably should just do that really quick. It honestly is so easy to use. Uh, so that when I wake up in the morning tomorrow... My hair's like done. Um, I also need to decide right now if I'm gonna work out in the morning or not because tomorrow's a very busy day of like back-to-back -back things. If I don't work out in the morning, it ain't happening. So, but I am gonna be walking a lot tomorrow. So I'm very pro walk. And if I'm not working out, I think a long walk is amazing. Ugh, I hate the lighting in my bathroom. That's the one thing I miss from my old, from my apartment last year 
was the my mirror in my bathroom had like LED lights behind it. I actually I purchased these on Amazon LED strip lights and I wanted to basically put them around like somewhere on my medicine cabinet because that's how my old one was. I mean it was in the mirror but this will do just to give it that glow and that better lighting. But I just keep forgetting about it and I'm definitely not starting that project now. One thing about me though, I do love a late night project. I really do. Also, Tangle Teaser sent me more colors. You guys know this is my favorite hairbrush, but they sent me this. And they sent me a mini one. And I'm gonna bring it to Greece and just like always have it in my tote bag, not just to Greece, but just always gonna have that. So that's that made my day. It was very exciting. I didn't know Tangle Teaser had many hair mini hairbrushes, so I'll show you guys really briefly again the Dyson Air Straight. Um, okay, here's the Air Straight. It literally looks like a flat iron, but you don't like heat it up. This is this this doesn't get hot. What happens is when you clamp it, see these little air vents? They blow air down as your hair is going down. It's crazy. And uh, so when you turn it on, it does this little thing. It's cleaning. And then you can choose wet or dry hair. I think it changes the way the air blows, the temperature, but my hair is dry now. So they say you only need up to three passes per hair, like per, you know, section that you pick. Uh, and you're also supposed to go pretty slow so that it can really get everything. But just watch. I went a little extra slow on that one. I just can't believe it's not a, a flat iron. Like it's just blowing straight air and making your hair nice and smooth. And they did it on all different types of hair, like super curly hair. I was very, very impressed. So yeah, I'm just gonna do the rest of my hair so I can go to bed and my hair is like not super crazy. Okay, I have to like do a couple touch-ups for, for the most part, except for the front. My whole head of hair is done. It literally took me like eight minutes. My hair is also short, but um, what I've been liking to do, what I've been impressed with, just so my hair in the front's not super like flat, like I want like a little bit of body, I take my front pieces and then I clamp them in and blow dry them up. It gives a little, I could definitely do that one more time, but, you know, so it gives you a little volume in the front. But obviously I'll touch this up in the morning. I just wanted to make sure I got my freshly showered hair just a little bit tamed before I go to sleep because then otherwise it, it'll just be even harder to style in the morning. But isn't this so impressive? All right, friends, it's time for bed. We have a big day tomorrow, but I just, I'm gonna get in bed. It's 10.30 now. I'm gonna read my book right now. I'm reading um, The Housemaid's Secret, which is the sequel to The Housemaid, which I really enjoyed. I took a break and read an Ellen Hildebrand book. Um, and then after that, I also read One of Us is Dead by Geneva Rose, which was really good. And now I'm reading. Um, I should probably like pre-download some books for Greece because I'm sure I'm going to read a lot on the plane and like hopefully when we're chilling by the pool and at the beach and all that. Wow. This vlog is probably so annoying. For Greece, for Greece. But like this is such a big trip. I'm so excited. I'm going with my friends. It's like, it's not like an influencer trip or anything. Like it's just a trip we've had planned for so long and it's like finally happening. So I'm going to brush my teeth and then I'll hit the hay. I'll see you guys in the morning.
Hi everybody. Okay, I was like having this leisurely morning and then I realized like we don't really have time for that, Danielle. We don't really have time to have a leisurely morning. Like you gotta get ready, you have to prep. So I'm doing all these things today. I'm starting off with a coffee meeting um, with Brooke and um, someone from the Way team, the hair care company. So I'm very excited about that. Um, and then from there, sorry, I'm just trying to pick out a pair of sunglasses. And then from there, does this work? It's just gonna have to. From there, we're I'm going to a Jenny Bird jewelry preview. I'm actually really excited. I don't have any Jenny Bird items, and I really want to see their jewelry. It's at Nine Orchard in, in uh, Soho. And then from there, I have a meeting. Hopefully, I'm gonna eat lunch at some point within there. Um, I'm going to a meeting with a potential financial advisor because I've never had one. My parents have always been so amazing and helpful, but I was kind of talking with them and we were like, it's probably time to maybe get some help and just make sure, I don't know, just kind of plan for the future. Like if I want to save for a house like a long time from now, a car again in the future, like stuff like that and like how much rent I should be paying if I were to move next year, stuff like that. I want help. So I have a meeting uptown, um, so it's like I gotta wear something kinda, I don't know. It's not business, obviously, but it's this denim jumpsuit from Eticon Revolve, I love it. And the shoes, I'm just wearing my Nike Air Forces, I put my foot inserts in there, we'll take a bag. I might be a little chilly at first, but it's getting up to 70, so I'm like, let's just go. But meeting with Brooke, and um, we're meeting up with someone from the Way team at Cafe Lyria in, so in like NoHo, which I've been really wanting to try, so let's go. Show you, like, right, right. You want them to put them on and then. Yeah, look what I found. Yes. Look how cute. I was just with her yesterday, and then she yeah. walks in. Oh my god, those look good on you too. <laughs> I want to try on the darker them. lenses. They're really cute. Danielle will get you a. Um, I wish this was my balcony. Got some poppy. I'm obsessed with this jewelry over here. Like, look at these earrings. So cute. meeting it went very well I'm about to have another call in two minutes but stop by Trader Joe's because I was just like I, I can't like I need food I all, all I have are like eggs and toast here so and I am here and I want to cook I love cooking in my kitchen so I went to Trader Joe's I got some chicken steak and then like uh broccoli slash cauliflower and green beans so those are like two meals because I have like couscous and rice so those are two nights of dinners and then I got some berries, cantaloupe. I've been really into cottage cheese. Um, cantaloupe, did I already say that? Two cucumbers to eat with red pepper hummus. I've never tried Trader Joe's red pepper hummus. Four avocados, bananas, some hard boiled eggs. I literally hate myself, but it's just such a busy week, okay? I just want them already done. Love these bean rice and cheese burritos. And then also their chicken burritos. So I just keep those in the freezer. And then their quick lunches. And I've had a sweet tooth. I think it's because I'm on my period this week, so... These brookies will fulfill that for me. Haul is done. Surprise, surprise. I hopped in the shower for some reason. I just like, I can't stop showering. It just feels so good. Gonna get some more work done. Just chopped up. I'm probably not gonna eat all that, but chopped up cucumber. Have my hummus. We're gonna get back to work. Oh, also got some fun whey products today, which was really nice. They're mainly refills, honestly, because I use this every time I wash my hair. I use this every few washes. I've been wanting to try the scalp serum, so I'm very pumped. So I need to put those things away, but I'm gonna get back to work.
Dinner is served. I transparently cooked the broccoli and cauliflower way too long. They're super mushy. And we have the shaved steak with some sesame seeds and pearled couscous. Dinner for one tonight. Unfortunately, Ryan has to work late tonight. I was gonna make him dinner too, but that's okay. I I'm going to read because I'm obsessed with my book right now and I can't put it down. So I'm gonna read and eat dinner. What, what a concept. Making some nighty night hot tea. Making, and then I'm also doing my YouTube vlog thumbnail for the morning and some other things. And then I'm gonna get in bed and read more of my book because it is just that good. I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning, everybody. It's Wednesday morning. I've had a very busy morning because we, on Wednesdays, we upload the podcast. I upload a YouTube video. Booked a trip this morning that's not even until August, but um, we're going to Nantucket in August. I'm so excited. Don't tell anybody. No, okay. We went last year, and like I think now we're just going to make like Cabo and Nantucket our annual trips. So I'm very thankful that we could do that. We just literally loved Nantucket so much last year, and it's amazing in August. So but rooms were booking up, so we went ahead and I, I called this morning and booked us a room. I'm so excited. Um, another on-the-go type of day. I hate like being away from my apartment all day, but location-wise, it just makes sense for me to be gone. So I hope I packed everything correctly. It's one of those days. So I'm headed to my workout with Jane, my trainer. I work out with her once a week, um, and we do like strength training. So I'm wearing just some black biker shorts, whatever. I've got. I just got this. I think I told you guys already. This bag from Lululemon. I have it in black in the smaller version, and they have like an XL. And I was just like, I love my black ones so much. So I got this one as well for like grease too. Um, and then from there, I'm gonna shower at the gym. And I've got this big old bag. because so I have a pair of shoes I need to return at Bloomingdale's. I bought white sneakers. And well, that was before I found out I'm actually an eight and a half and not a seven and a half. And I just don't love the color of the white. I packed a change of clothes. I am doing a return for my friend Caitlin who was here last weekend because she doesn't have Zara at home and she like bought something at Zara here and then we went and the line was literally so long. I was like, let me go on a weekday, bring you my book because after I do all the returns, getting my nails done for Greece. Very excited, I'll show you guys what I'm thinking. And then from there, I'm going to Brooke's apartment and recording another episode of Gals and Go to be ahead. So I have like makeup and a change of clothes for that. So, and I need to get a water bottle, but we're gonna go because I like to walk to the gym. It's a nice walk. Um, I'm excited for the day, there's lots of It'll be nice to be outside. I'm excited. To, I'm going to go Soho for these returns. So I'll have to grab some lunch at some point, which sucks because I have dinner leftovers here. But I just, it'll be more stressful if I'm coming up and down all the time. So we're just going to stay in Soho and that area. Happy Wednesday. <laughs> done I'm so obsessed it's actually so crazy how getting designs actually is quicker don't know why so if you're ever like I don't want to sit there as long get a design at least this one was really quick I just did like the blue flowers went and stopped by my old stopping grounds pause cafe in Lower East Side got an iced decaf latte Brooke and I are about to record a really fun episode where people submitted so um, voice memos and we're gonna play them on the podcast and answer them and it's gonna be so much fun we've got our mics I've I know, got I haven't listened to them so it's gonna be a big surprise I know I think you're gonna enjoy them some I'm of them excited. I'm like oh my gosh I don't I clicked know clicked on a few because like oh you went and like email, but could you, you see were... the ones I starred no so oh. Danielle picked them out I'm excited to hear yes it should be a good episode gals I'm like it was just kind of popping right now I think so too I actually last night was in bed and did a deep dive of our TikTok 
and just was watching clips, laughing, laughing at our own. No, clips. we're so funny. I our clips are too. so funny. I think so too. I went back like starting a year ago, going up. I was like, wow, these are like Aww. fire episodes. Yeah. So if you're not a gal on the go yet, become one. Go listen, Gals on the Go podcast every Wednesday on YouTube too at 2 p.m. Eastern yep. Standard Time or midnight on t- on Tuesday night the night before audio. That was didn't make sense, but you guys get the vibes. It's somewhere. I'm just look. It's somewhere. <laughs> Whew, now we're in Upper East Side. I'm getting a dress hemmed. I'm, we've been everywhere. <laughs> Home, dress is getting altered, showered again, changed into PJs. It's slightly raining outside. I just started Aquamarine, which that means it's the start of the summer when I watch Aquamarine. And I'm gonna start making dinner. Things are happening here. I'm pulling aside things for Greece. That's stuff I'm not bringing to Greece. I'm trying to be very responsible. I have a whole slideshow of each day, activities we're doing, and what I will be wearing that day. Things could change, but this way, I don't. it's not like, oh, maybe I'll need that. It's all very purposeful, except for I added that blue set, and then I added this dress, and that's like a casual sundress. Everything else is an outfit for a dinner, an excursion, or something. That's my airport sweatsuit over there that'll be with me all the time. Bathing suits, I literally have like outfits, like cover-ups, like I never do this. And then these for the most part are my nighttime outfits right here um, that you guys saw me style with Cass. So I'm very proud of myself. I also decided to go backpack, I think, for this trip instead of a tote bag, or I might bring a backpack and a tote. I just have a lot of stuff that I want to bring, like travel essentials, like literally like this travel neck pillow. I got stuff like that. Um, and I saw this base expandable backpack. It has all these random bells and whistles. Like there's just all these really cool things about it. And I was like, you know what? Maybe I'm going to become a backpack girly again. So I'm very excited about this. I also am currently borrowing this bag from Full Word. I did not purchase it. So I have to take very good care of it. So I'm like, should I travel with it or should I put it in my suitcase? I don't really know, but it's gorgeous. And I've always wanted to use this bag. So very excited about that. Um, so yeah, I'm going to start packing and all of that. I don't know if you guys could tell earlier, but it was a mess in here. I put everything back in my closet. Like, well, you guys cannot tell, but there was so much on the ground. This was like overflowing. It's nice and clean. Got all my jewelry out for Greece that I want to bring. It's literally Wednesday and I don't leave till Saturday. But Friday's Taylor Swift, so I'm just trying to like get ahead. And I'm really proud of myself. I mean, look at this. I even put my shoes in a thing. Now the question is, and the hope is, that I can fit my toiletries, makeup bag, and like hair stuff and sunglasses all in there. But my shoes are already in. All of my clothes that I'm bringing are right there. And then that's my workout, my workout, my sweat set. Oh, and my bags. Yeah, those need to fit in there too, I think. Unless I want to travel with them. And my backpack. So I'm pretty proud. It's time to go to bed. I'm going to end the vlog here because I'm pretty sure it's pretty long. I'm making some hot tea as we speak. I am in need of like a little wind down. I've actually been listening to the Caller Daddy um, Ariana Maddox episode. Everyone like tells me I look like her. I don't know if you guys feel this way. I don't even watch the show, but this episode is quite interesting, even though, like, I feel like now I know a lot about it. But anyways, I love you guys endlessly. Get so excited. The next vlog will be my Taylor Swift vlog. Love you guys. Mm -hmm.